Well, I believe life is a maze and that's why we are playing Labyrinth City today which is developed by Darjeeling and published by Pixman and has just released today, the 22nd of June. Now this is uh, on a children's comic book, this is adapted on a children's comic book, Pierre the Detective. The straightest line isn't always the shortest way from A to B. This old saying will prove true in the adventure that follows. Everything seems quiet in Opera City. That's where Pierre, the expert maze detective, lives. But beware of appearances. Beware of still waters and crackling fire. Because at this precise moment, his friend Carmen rocks up in trouble. Pierre, Pierre, somebody stole the stone, Pierre, she says. The maze stone. Mr. X is the one behind it. I just came from the museum. He replaced the stone with a letter for you. Dear worthless detective, I now have the stone. The one that turns everything into mazes. I challenge you to get it back. Are you up to it? Signed, Mr. X. P.S. Ah, 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 ah. With not a minute to lose, they race to the museum. It's total chaos inside. Well, that was some amazing voice acting, if you ask me. Oh, wow. I mean, uh, the graphics on this is amazing. Okay, this is where the maze stone was exhibited and Mr. X may not be far away. Let's go question these policemen. All right, Carmen. So this is uh, basically like they've tried to, you know, one of those picture puzzle books. They have tried to bring it out into the game reality for us. And the thing is, we're looking at the inside of a museum and the museum has somehow turned to life. Why? Because of that stone and its magic. They're saying it's not a good time. We've got our hands full and it's such an absolute chaos. But then they realize that I'm the maze expert, Pierre. So I've come at the right time and the director is waiting for me. That dude looks so scared. Well, I would be too. Look at the situation. My God, this is just like so much to just take in in a glance. Okay, the graphics on this is top notch, man. Look at that. King Kong is hanging. There is, there are Viking warriors up there and there are also some Roman legionnaires. And the road up there was hidden behind the curtain. Amazing. Oh, so we've got this uh, dinosaur bones. So basically there are these small chests around which you can get to collect. Have you imagined a game where, you know, we could play in a, in a, or have a squad of Roman legionnaires with some Viking barbarians. That would be an interesting game. In Pierre's labyrinth world, this is actually possible. Well, some of these uh, artifacts or sculptures are not really troublesome. Okay, so there are so many small interactions to click on. That's interesting. He's a ninja and he collects stars. I can have to learn from you. Oh, you can move without moving. You're gonna reach the star before me? You sure? You sure you can do that? <laughs> okay. Well, so we, there are three stars along the map, I get it. Look at the depth of detail on this, my god. There's something new to watch all the time, I mean... Okay, so did you see that? There's a arrow, purple arrow on that artist's canvas. It's like uh, they know where you're going, where you might get stuck or which angle you might go wrong in. What does this polar bear have to say? Wait, what? We can move the paintings. Oh, we have to put the painting straight. Not good Feng Shui. I I agree. I agree. So, so this is kind. Of, these paintings have become kind of like uh, from the Harry Potter world. Okay, so one issue is definitely there. Missing his leg and arms. Oh, so that she's 
commenting on that sculpture somehow that ha that bust hasn't come awake <laughs> that's a monkey in the mona lisa okay monkey lisa i don't know so oh that's i think the secret achievement or the secret trophy is just one of that in each level Ooh, that was so beautiful that animation was so amazing to look at i mean the depth of detail on this this must have taken hours to make mother of god i i really have to appreciate the kind of effort gone into this i mean this is priced at just uh, just under 400 uh, rupees i think it's a steal it's a moose eating a painting while a policeman or a guard tries to pet it interesting what's this oh uh, it's some kind of a museum handbook that archer is very bad at his aim but okay i'm going to let him have that it's a dinosaur it's a dinosaur for christ sake i i it, this uh, does remind me of that movie night in the museum also the director is right there but we can't reach him because of those people there and the pharaoh is sneezing while a god looks on angrily roman god maybe i don't know who sculpture that is wait okay so we have to go all the way around that way i understand how is it that this uh, sculpture isn't alive so many others are even anubis isn't alive Wait, what happens? Oh, I was expecting a cannon pop to go off, cannon ball to go off. We found the director finally. My God, it's a hectic maze. There's worse, huh? If we don't find Mishkar X, the career your career is over. High tech, tip top security, huh? Oh, he's right here still. And you even know where he is, and you're still sitting around. Damn, director, you're. pathetic okay then let me handle it director wow i i am loving the effect of this sculpture those are six arms you know that does look like kali from the back and it's against poseidon c c c d e d well i have learned those those are music chords got to the wedding oh so basically are you two getting married to each other Holy mother of god did Poseidon just lightning bolt sorry did Zeus just lightning bolt Kali Okay so the road we have to go is down So then definitely I will go up because well that's what we've learned as gamers haven't we Go the opposite way first Okay so we get some clues too Uh I did not get that but okay I didn't know there were clues too. It's a samurai fighting a knight. That's so am amazing. It's like out of that episode of uh, Deadliest Warrior. Oh, there's a star here. A delivery for me. It's a page from X's notebook and the purple arrows will come in handy. Oh, it's another clue. So basically there's a delivery guy waiting. It, it, it's like Mr. X just doesn't, uh, you know, is doesn't think you are even worth being bothered about he is just going to uh, i don't know i mean taunt you and treat you like a kid and to be honest to be honest you are one so you have to go all the way back and get that uh, take a picture why don't i take you you'd go that way ha huh? but if i were you i wouldn't be very confident oh i get you Wow, another clue. Okay, so this is basically telling us how to make uh, or how to fix that uh, puzzle of the paintings. Oh, well, I mean not bad, huh? We got three clues when we didn't even know those clues existed. And we also got the third uh, star even though it meant that we had to backtrack a little. But to be honest it doesn't really matter because look at the detail on this I'm sorry I just had to check whether we're still recording I can't 
uh, believe I'm getting to have such an amazing experience. It, it, it's very well made. I mean, the detail on this. This came out. I think this was their last team summer sale too. Oh, we found the fourth clue too. But I don't know what it means. I don't know. Probably telling me the route or something. Oh, we nearly got stomped by that mammoth. Oh, I spot a box there. And it's a toy woolly mammoth. You know, so basically, uh, wherever those loot boxes are, you would find uh, a toy. Come, I mean, what is similar to some uh, exhibit around it? There you are, X, Mr. X. Hey, Carmen, were you there all the time? You, I took my time, huh? You giving me the stone? This must be. It can't be that straightforward. Pierre and Carmen confront Mr. X. The stone is within reach, but the rat has a trick up his sleeve. On his signal, a horde of monkeys hurtles down the stairs. They're super cute, but angry and out of control. Oh, what a rascal. What a rotten scumbag. Using the chaos as a distraction, he escapes at the last minute and is lost in the city suburbs. Oh, so this is level two, I'm guessing. So I think this is this uh, second level is new in this team fest demo. Okay, so this is the outside world and it's a mess even outside. Did I see somebody shady? There's loads of shady people around here. It's a carnival today and everybody is dressed. There are a group of your colleagues nearby. They surely tell me something, huh? Okay. So basically, this is where we have to go right now. These uh, policemen here. I don't know what they're doing out there in the middle of everything. It's just a street across, but this, that street is jam-packed. That sculpture is having a very casual conversation with a man. I mean, that's the sculpture of Buddha. Okay then, so basically it's a carnival out here, all the uh, exhibits became alive inside. Interesting. What's this dude saying? Oh, he's telling us where we need to go. Wow, he painted a sign for us. This dude's a sorceress. Or sorry, sorcerer. Hey, don't cut me off like that. Wow. Hey, it's that ninja again. I actually didn't see him. Yeah, you know, you were very well hidden. Yes, I did get that star. And you know what? I'm going to get this one too. And to stop you, I'm going to open a door and have some water pour out. There's a damn goldfish inside that car. What? I mean... <laughs> okay. So uh, even the art style or I mean sorry not the art style the style of all the vehicles are definitely uh, 70s uh, that's what I'm guessing if I'm accurate this dude is fishing for something I don't know what okay so there's nothing behind these windows but it's interesting that even these things are available as an interaction I mean it, this this game doesn't cease to amaze me, I, I swear. Look at that, there's a monkey playing and an entire band here. Wow! That policeman is marching to the tune. You guys are not police? This is fancy dress for the carnival? You're keeping an eye on some fake bandits. They're going to attack a real bank for laugh. What's he look like, this ex? Well, he has a cape, a mask and a big hat. You've seen him? He's near the fish restaurant. That doesn't look like him, but okay, I'll go along with the game. I, the level of detail is too much. I can't narrate everything. It's impossible. I hope you guys look around more than I do. Because he's not in costume. That's why you're arresting him. Okay. 
We got a clue. That was random. A uh, set of stairs. Okay, something to do with stairs. Some ramen noodles. I don't know. Pig, piggy pizza or pizza. Piggy pizza. Yes, definitely. But then there's nothing to go inside there. There are some people working during the carnival on that ledge on the right. Imagine that. Not everybody thinks it's a joke. Wow. These fake bandits have a really huge car. They seem pretty well off. I'm not sure whether they are fake or real. I spot a star and some balloons got let out of that uh, car. I can't reach that star. I'll have to go all around. I understand. Okay, so that car is floating now. <laughs> That's amazing. What? I can go inside? That's some. That's pretty uh, sneaky, you know, I would have missed that if I wasn't checking. It's a safe full of gold bars. Or not full of, there's just three gold bars. Okay, can't go down that road, let's go back. And there is also a joker trying some cans behind those bandits so that, you know, they let out a lot of sound when they try to drive away in this uh, traffic jam. Okay, so there, there's somebody proposing there. There's, there's nothing inside that car. Wow, there's a small plaza here. There's a carnival going on inside here. So these dudes are like genuinely enjoying themselves. Foul, that's gold. That's not a dog, it's a foul. What? Hey, I spot X. He's right there on the left. But then unfortunately, I can't reach him. So I think I will, I mean the game does want me to progress along uh, a certain set of chapters. It's kind of frustrating. Hey, it's the polar bear. Oh, those mariachis have to play the right thing. We'll play you a tune and then you, I will have to play it back. Two, three, two, four, three, five. Okay, so two, three, two, four, three, five. Get it. And five. Well, that went well. And we have again got that second uh, secret trophy. So the polar bear is the mission giver. I get it. Next time we have to. Wherever we spot the polar bear, there is where that hidden, uh, I don't know, a prize or award is. It's a carnival set, huh? It's a toy of some sorts of that uh, roundabout. Okay, so two boxes or two loot boxes, I don't know what else to call it. Boxes, stars and clues, yeah? Hey, there's a fire eater here and these seem to be Eastern. Interesting. That dude is trying to uh, tight walk. Okay, there's another box here. Hey, it's a balloon of me and Carmen. You know, I'm, I'm beginning to, uh, to suspect Carmen isn't just a normal friend. Wink, wink. That person is really dancing with her. Who wants a balloon seller disguise? No, not me. Red noses, fake noses, clown noses, comedy noses. Well, that was star one. And I'm not a joker, so no noses. Ice drink. Ice cream I would have preferred. Hey, this, that dude, is that dude Dej or something? Also, is one of uh, this is one of those magician or sorcerer dudes. They paint signs for us to show us the right road. But this is amazing. I mean, look at the detail on this. I mean, it's not that you're going to get tired of it. I would really, really recommend uh, this for children. I mean. 
i don't know under the age of 10 it's uh, very very imaginative well you are not mr x i know that too people often mix you up with somebody else huh he's purple saw him near the elephant parade okay then this is also not the dude i know where mr x is but unfortunately you see this, this is the really frustrating part of the game okay so there is another star oh so this is what that clue was about uh, you know it had a kind of mind numbing or uh, i don't know 3d puzzle view of these stairs of sorts or pathways of sorts okay we've got all three stars thank god for that we can really slide down uh, ladders huh wants a donut no actually i don't you know fooled me nobody fools me you're not a donut seller really huh okay so basically i need to go up there that's interesting so that's why this road is closed so this is a dead end and that magician come sorcerer guided us back along the right road see it's these uh, small features in a game that really really make the difference especially if there are i mean if it's designed for kids it should be easily understandable it should really help them or you know guide them in case they are obviously lost also i didn't notice this uh, draw bridge there are elephant dancers here Wow so would we be hidden from screen if we go along that way that would be interesting to watch Yep There's a dancing bear with goggles sunglasses he is really cool He you are Mr X what I came as Pierre the famous maze uh the detective Oh you did see somebody else huh so where did you see him Finally we've got the correct Mr X This dude really thinks he dresses better than the original Mr X and that my costume isn't that great You know what good day to you too sir Well I I don't know what this dude is trying to is he trying to organize a race in the middle of such a busy street here There's nothing in there huh okay There's a loot box. Hey, it's a miniature toy of the car that dude is riding right there. That's nice. Dare drink, okay? D E A drink, maybe? Mini racing car is the bomb. Yeah, obviously you know what you're talking about. You are driving the larger version of it. What flowers how original but what's the occasion huh? I actually I leave you to to it I have a dangerous criminal to catch I nearly got spiked by that bull This dude's heads off Have we finally reached him oh there was Carmen waiting for us Carmen if you already knew to the road then why don't you take me along with you Swift as a tiger, Mr. X bounds onto the rooftops, and then, oh, the cad, he planned it all. Moa, oh, sometimes my intelligence surprises even me. And he escapes into the skies. Pierre, look up there. Ah ah ah, hi you lot down there. Hi ants, hi slugs. All is not lost, says Carmen. I have a friend who builds flying machines. Her name's Coco. She's an adventurer. She travels all over the world, but her HQ is here, somewhere in the city center. We must find it. 
Well guys and gals that was the game and I swear I mean it's a visual treat I would definitely recommend this for uh, children if you have children at home it's a steal at the price that it's currently available in I leave the link uh, to their steam page down in the description below so that you can go and check it out if you enjoyed this video then do smash that like button and consider sharing and subscribing cuz well that would really bring a smile to my face This is Ashish Bashas signing off until next video game on